a small New England town. It feels just like Stars Hollow. It is so cute and quaint. I'm gonna start my day with getting some coffee, of course. I already had a coffee in my hotel room, but I'm gonna go get another one. And we're gonna go book shopping. We're gonna go to the library. There's autumn leaves everywhere. It feels like Gilmore Girls. I hope you guys enjoy. I know in my book haul video or in my book recommendations video for fall I had stated something along the lines of I would not be purchasing new books until I finished all the ones on my reading list or something like that since I'm in Concord Massachusetts that was just very unrealistic goal of me to set as this is like one of the most famous literary cities in the world so of course I'm gonna buy books while I'm here so here's my little book haul the first one is my Antonia by Willa Cather I always see this and I always want to get it and then I never do and I saw this one at the used bookshop here in Concord at the same used bookstore I bought this copy of Walden and I actually saw this same one on Amazon and I almost bought it and I'm so glad I did not because I like to support like local like used bookshops instead of purchasing on Amazon when I can. Next is Flower Fables by Louise May Alcott. I have not read a ton of the other books by Louise May Alcott that are a little less popular, so I really wanted to try to get into those. And this is one that I'm most excited for. This is a Barnes & Noble cloth bound classics, but I bought it at a local bookshop here in Concord. I'm gonna buy myself another copy of Little Women. I already have five of them, but this is a cloth bound classic and I've always wanted this copy so I went ahead and bought it when in Rome, you know? And I didn't purchase this on this trip but I got it right before I came here so that I would have something to read. This is Bunny, it's set in New England. It's about a group of girls that basically are in like this uh, like cult. And well, it's, it's a really weird book, it's kind of hard to explain. I finished it, loved it. Probably one of my top 10 favorite books now. raining here today which I'm so happy because I love the rain especially in autumn. I'm taking myself on a little walk to the old north bridge in Concord. It's this really pretty historical bridge. They have the Minuteman statue there. Sort of a, not sort of, it's a national historic park but it's a very scenic walk. My dad would be so pissed at me right now if he knew I was walking here without like a real uh, like path but I'm walking against the traffic so you're supposed to do that. But I've been listening to like this cozy, like rainy day autumn playlist. And it has like all these like throwback songs that I used to listen to back in the day, but just like all the classic rainy day songs. Also my period started today. I'm so sad. I expected it to happen while I was on this trip, but 
you know, sometimes you're just like, maybe it won't happen or something stupid. It's made me very emotional and moody today, which I guess matches the, the rainy day vibe, but it's kind of annoying. I know I'll be okay tomorrow. It's just something you gotta get through. I'm just gonna go be somber for a little bit. I'm really glad my grandma made me bring this umbrella with me. So I made it here. I'm at the Old Manse, which is Ralph Waldo Emerson's grandfather's house that he built. And there's like this little boathouse, which you're leading up against right now. And then it overlooks the Concord Bridge, which is very scenic and very beautiful, especially on this rainy day that we're having here today. My bangs look so funny. They just look silly. I don't, I don't know how to fix it, but that's fine. library in Concord. This is the Concord Public Library and it is so 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 beautiful so I'm gonna take you along with me as we explore and do some reading. very jealous of all the locals that live here and get to come here like every single day. I'm sorry there's like a bunch of background noise. There's a ton of cars out right now. I can't even believe I'm vlogging right now because there's so many people watching through their car windows. It's fine. I'm facing my fears. One of my biggest fears being vlogging in public. Anyways, this library is gorgeous. I wish I could come here every day. If I could, I would. I love libraries. I think they're so beautiful. The Concord Public Library. You guys should all come here if you're in Massachusetts. Thank you. 